ten, ten, ten. something a little different today. Do you all remember the number groups you were in last night? Yes. 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 Music as an art needs three things to survive. You need composers who create the music, you need performers who perform the music, because music is a performing art. It has to have that, that uh, group of people who will take what's on the written page and recreate the music, and then you need people to listen. And music education needs to serve all three of those areas in some way. I direct the University of Maine Symphonic Band, which is our top auditioned ensemble. They perform uh, two concerts a semester, and in the spring they tour throughout the state for four days to help recruit for the university. Then I direct the University of Maine Marching Band, and uh, they perform in the fall for football games, local uh, parades and events, and we do an exhibition at the state marching show to uh, recruit kids from there as well. And I direct the Screaming Black Bears Pet Band, which meets in the fall and spring, and they play at all home men's ice hockey games and all home men's and women's basketball games, and we perform other little functions on campus as needed as well. He puts a lot of pride in, you know, making sure, you know, we have a system, the system works, we have a plan. If we put the plan in action, we'll get everything done in no time, and we just keep going. Um, so as long as you stick to the plan, stick to the system, everything, you know, works perfectly. Mr. White, um, he's a, as any band director would, they're, they're just like the, the parent of the band, so it's kind of just like... He is the mediator. He tells you what to do and what you cannot do. And then sometimes he makes it fun. Sometimes it's like you have to work to do the best that you can in a band. So um, it's really nice working with him. Um, I mean, he's been working here for a very long time. So he's kind of looks like an uncle to me, basically. So <laughs> Mr. Wright's teaching style is very uh, student oriented because um, the band couldn't run without its, its students. And I think he realizes that and puts a lot of effort into putting the students and their thoughts into the show. So like for instance, to choose the shows for next year, he gathers all the student leaders, so drum majors and section leaders, and we kind of you know throw out our thoughts on what we want the show to be. So he recognizes that and definitely works with us. He does also you know push us a lot. Um, that's how you get better at, at, at something. Um, but it, it's definitely student-oriented. I enjoy the students and interacting with them. I enjoy making music. Each year becomes even more enjoyable because I do think we have a rich history here and they're becoming part of what we're doing. So I enjoy sharing that with them. And I enjoy sharing what we have at the university when we go off campus because I don't think everyone always knows all the things that go on here. And just when we can get out in the public, um, Everyone's appreciative, and some of them are even surprised, like, wow, I didn't know. And as soon as we can 
take someone and says, wow, I didn't know, and they have a positive experience, I think it's a great thing for all of us. Thank you.